Hi, hello guys. Welcome to my YouTube channel, India Doctor Strange. In this video, I am going to share with you the tricks to master the clinical based MCQs in NEET PG 2022 examination. Nowadays, the clinical based MCQs are the one which is used asked in the NEET PG examination. So, you must give more importance to these clinical MCQs and you should learn how to identify the key points and how to solve these clinical based MCQs. Okay. So, without wasting further time, let's get into the video. I am going to share with you six tricks to master these clinical based MCQs. Okay, number one, read each and every word of the questions carefully. This is the area some aspirants make a mistake. They won't read each and every word of the clinical MCQs correctly. Even the age, sex are more important in finding the clinical based MCQs. So, give more importance to reading each and every word of the clinical based mcqs okay number two rule out the option rather than just jumping into the answer if we read a clinical based mcqs we have the tendency uh, to just uh, find out the answer and just jump into the correct answer don't do this just try to uh, rule out the other options why other options can't be the right way to find out the answer and rule out such answer and try to find out the correct answer okay let me discuss with you uh, yeah, clinical based mcqs example uh, a 32 year old software engineer who is uh, feeling tired so feeling tired is some uh, you can uh, find out towards uh, some kind of anemia he is having so that he is feeling very tired and on uh, examination his uh, hemoglobin is 9 gram per deciliter so he is anemic okay and the mcv is more than 125 fl so it part towards the macrocytic anemia so you, you can rule out the options like sideroblastic anemia can't be the answer you, you can uh, rule out sideroblastic anemia and uh, iron deficiency anemia can also cannot be the answer because it is a macrocytic anemia. So we are stuck with the uh, two answer. If you just read out the answer, he is eating junk foods regularly for a few months and avoids vegetables. We have a tendency to find out uh, to mark the first option, right? Vitamin B12 deficiency, but it is not the answer. Just read out. He is eating junk foods regularly for a few months and avoids vegetables. Okay, so he is eating uh, non veg, but he is avoiding vegetable. Folate is the thing which is uh, rich in vegetables. So, vitamin B12 cannot be the answer. The correct answer will be folate deficiency. This is how you have to uh, find out which is the correct answer in case of a clinical based MCQs. This is, you, this is the way of solving clinical based MCQs. And number three give more importance to the image based questions because these clinical based mcqs will have a uh, certain type of uh, images will be provided to you so you have to learn how to uh, find out the image and how to deal out the image i will give you some tips first you, you have to see uh, each and every corner of the image what this image is supposed to be and then we have to see the uh, center of the image don't just see what is in the middle of the image and uh, come to a conclusion just uh, see each and every corner of the images too okay this is the third point and uh, the fourth point is read the notes in a clinical way if you are um, reading a notes uh, regarding any uh, topic you can uh, you can also set a uh, uh, mm, question if, if you are an examiner how will you set a clinical basis cqs from this topic you have to read in such a way and try to uh, read each and every topic in a clinical way and be more attentive while solving clinical mcqs okay so as i have previously said you have to be more attentive in reading the clinical based mcqs and uh, rule, ruling out the options too so and give more importance to previous year questions uh, uh, in the previous year questions uh, that may be in a non-clinical way but that questions may be asked in a clinical way in the coming up exam so you more importance to the previous year questions and and uh, most important of this is do more clinical mcqs if you keep on doing more clinical mcqs it, you can easily master these clinical based mcqs and you can become a topper in the need pages 2022 so practice makes a man perfect so 
do more MC, clinical based MCQs, at least 100 clinical based MCQs in a day, and you can master the clinical based MCQs. Thank you, and do well in the NEET PG examination. Prepare well. If you are having any doubt, just pin me in the message. I'll be replying you. Thank you, and subscribe my YouTube channel, India Doctor Strange, for more updates. Stay in tune. Tata, bye bye.